uh, for these later game rounds for sure, okay? <laughs> he is not happy. That is definitely likely. Oh, he's power locking me too. Great. Great, great, great. Yeah. Oh my God. He's got quick shot too. Oh. Yo, what is up guys? It's your boy Boltrix here. Back with yet another bango. We're going to be playing some BFB Coliseum free power up. So let's hop right in today's video. If you guys are in fact new to the channel, do not forget to click that subscribe button. And also while you're at it, drop a like. On today's video, it's gonna be a banger, cause it always is. Silence is gonna be our first opponent, all right? He definitely looks pretty good for sure. But the goal for today's video is to go late game, okay? I actually want to create my own late game strategy, okay? Frozen River is gonna end up being the map, so the strategy that I had in mind was Ninja Village glue all right i don't think i've ever seen a video made on this strategy it's not going to be the best but i think we can make it work out so without further ado let's just hop right into this one boys getting the positive vibes and we shall indeed win okay so we're gonna end up starting off with the ninja as our first popping power tower okay now i know the ninja is not the greatest starting tower by any means so that's what sucks about the strategy but as long as we can make it to the late game rounds i think we should be good okay because we are in free power ups therefore we can rely off our good power combination consisting of the damage boost, glue storm, and the super ego boost. That's going to tremendously help us out. And we just got to stick to the game plan, boys, okay? Be really, really consistent with group deco. Have pretty good defenses. And we should be in the clear, all right? It looks like he is going with the dart lane. I never noted that. My bad. And also, he is, in fact, farming as well, okay? So he's probably going dart lane village. Actually, I don't know. He could be going a variety of different strategies. Maybe Dartling Boomer. I guess we'll just have to wait and see what happens. But if he is going Dartling Boomer, Dartling Boomer is not a good late game strategy by any means. Okay, so he's probably not going to be wanting to go late. Therefore, he's going to try to be aggressive. And oh, okay. So he's actually going with the bomb. Switch up of the century. I did not expect that. But Dartling Bomb Farm is a pretty good strategy okay so props are using that man so i forgot to use my super ego boost on round five so i decided to do it on round six he's gonna be sending me a few greens here okay so definitely i'm gonna have to stop echoing for a second i'm gonna send him some space eco on his side and uh yeah we're not gonna be liking this too much okay we can probably yeah we're gonna glue storm this okay it sucks but it's just what we gotta do because that was a lot of green sent <laughs> a freaking crap ton his farm game doesn't look too good, so that's probably why he was able to send so many. But that's fine, all right? Let's get back to Equin in a little bit. We're at 477 right now. I can't believe my double shot can't defend. What the heck? Constant space black should be a breeze. So I'm going to stop Equin right here. 542 Eco. He was leaking consistent lives to those greens. I'm going to use my next Super Eco Boost. He's got the dual Eco Boost, okay? So Super Eco Boost is a little bit better, but still, he's got an Eco Power, okay? So he might just want to go late. He's going to end up sending me some yellows here, okay? So might just have to use my second glue storm. I'm probably going to do that, yeah. Definitely going to do that. Way too many yellows. I actually did not have enough money to upgrade, so I was a little bit nervous right there, but I think ultimately we're going to be good. Eventually, though, we have to go for this balloon jutsu. Oh, my gosh. I'm so close to getting it. I I'm going to have to boost this, I think. Going to have to boost this. Let's get the balloon jutsu finally. My freaking goodness, man. Okay, so we're not off to the greatest start, but we just got to stay confident, boys. Okay, we're going to end up putting this bad boy on strong. Okay, he's probably pretty surprised that I'm using this strategy because definitely is quite weird indeed. Uh, but we're just going to save up all of our money. I'm going to use my Super Eco Boost at the start of round 12. That will push us a little bit further with the Eco. And it looks like he's going to be sending me a little bit something. Yeah, okay. So I think we should be fine with that. I'm going to end up getting up the Glue Hose just to help us out a little bit more. And with the Balloon Jitsu in the back of the map, we should be able to clean all that up. Ooh, okay. So did regrow a little bit. Gonna end up leaking a few lives. But ultimately, we are good. Okay, so let's get it. He's going to send me some Camelettes. Okay. And even more camo balloons and a lot more camo balloons. Okay, so we're about to get this in any second here. This uh, radar scanner. There we go. Got it. Okay. I know it looks bad right now. Might leak a few lives here and there, but ultimately we're going to be good. Let's go, boys. Holy crap. He has been so freaking aggressive towards me, man. So unbelievably aggressive. We are definitely going to be sending him, like, not a rush, but just eco, so he has to upgrade his defenses. I mean, look at his farm gate, ladies and gentlemen. He's literally got one, one, zero farm. That is literally it. This man is screwed for the late game rounds, okay? I am very, very confident now. We just got to make sure that we stay consistent with his eco. And honestly, we should be pretty good. He's actually leaking to the pigs I'm sending him. And round 16 AI is not going to be a breeze for him by any means. He's going to, yeah, he's going to have to put money into his defenses, boys. He is freaking consistently leaking as we speak okay so let's start to send these pinks he's gonna send me a why are you sending me a rush why are you sending me oh my gosh he's literally just gonna die to the ai he's gonna end up using an acid if we have to boost this obviously i will 
I'm gonna end up boosting that because that's a lot of regens, okay? And he ends up going down. What were you thinking, brother? All right, so the strategy technically worked right there, but I do want to go late game with it, okay? So GG's, man. I will catch you on the next one. Lair Noob is gonna be our next opponent. All right, so we got the map Treasure Hunt. I really should just disconnect from this game. However, I'm feeling ballsy right now. We're gonna end up trying to use the strategy and see if it works. It probably won't. So once again, let's just get right into this one, boys. Good and positive vibes, and we shall indeed win. We're gonna need a lot more than that, I think, okay? Because this is actually gonna be so extremely hard. I'm gonna end up obviously starting off with the ninja. As I already said, the ninja is not the greatest starting tower. Luckily though, our last opponent wasn't too aggressive during the early game rounds, okay? Rather, he was aggressive during those uh, mid game rounds, but ended up still getting the dub regardless. He's gonna be sending me some reds, okay? So I definitely have to go for a 2 1 ninja here. No if ands, or buts about it. And he might just be ecoing as well, which is not a good sign, okay? Because he's probably got a better eco strategy than me, and he might still be able to be aggressive towards me. I'm not entirely sure. I'm gonna go for the double shot already because I already know I can't defend against constant blues on round four. He's gonna have to upgrade though to the quad darts as well, so. Definitely want to stay pretty consistent with those. And I don't know, boys, maybe we have a chance. He's probably going Heli Village Sniper, which is a pretty broken strategy, but I guess we'll just have to wait and see what happens. And there's not that much land on this map, so, like, we're very limited with the amount of towers that we can have, okay? Like, we can only go so late, you know what I mean? But these blues look way worse on his side, okay? He's going to have to stop equaling for a second. There he goes for the quad darts upgrade, okay? So, at least we forced that on his side. But look, boys, it's already starting to get a little bit harder for us. We're gonna end up using our first super eco boost here, and I guess we're just gonna have to tank those lives. Unfortunately, it just has to happen. Let's use our super eco boost. He's also got the super eco boost. You love to freaking see it, all right? Somehow, though, he's actually leaking too. So I, I guess we'll take it. I'm gonna make sure that I stay pretty consistent with these. He's gonna end up sending me space pinks behind that too. Oh, that's just rude. Yeah, I think he's going Heli Village Sniper Boys, which is a pretty broken strategy, all right? Uh, but let's make sure that we send consistent greens here. Yeah, figure two's gonna do the same thing at me. We do have a glue storm to rely off of, and he probably does as well, to be honest with y'all. <laughs> he's got to, right? I mean, oh no, he's got a lightning. Okay, so that also works for sure. And I'm just gonna have to stop ecoing here, boys. I mean, it, it sucks, but <laughs> this is this is just getting a little bit too hard for us. Okay, so do what what do I want to go for here? Probably just another ninja. So yeah, I'm gonna do that really quickly. I want to get up my village first, but. It just sucks that we can't. And he's smiling at us. He probably knows. <laughs> he freaking knows, boys, that he's got this in the bag pretty much as long as he does not choke. Yep, there he goes with the village. And then he's going to be getting up the sniper. Okay, so, yeah, not, not looking too good for us, boys. And, yep, okay, I, I can read kids like books. I always do, man. I always do. There's no way he chokes this, right? Like, he literally, like, he, he can't lose. He's literally not, he's not losing this. I'm telling you guys right now, he's not going to lose this, okay? So... Obviously, I'm just gonna glue storm that because that is a crap ton of yellows that I was not ready for. Okay, I'm gonna end up getting up our glue. I'm gonna send him. A, oh, why? I don't even know why I'm sending him a lead, but whatever. Let's just get this corrosive glue up. Oh my freaking goodness, boys! This really, really does suck. I won't even lie. It really does. Oh wait, those are not corrosive though. Those are not corrosive. Oh no, this is looking bad. I don't think those leads are gonna actually pop. Oh, and he's already got that freaking sniper up, man. That's so OP, man. Okay, I'm gonna go for my last super ego boost here. It, it's not looking too good for us, boys. I won't lie. That lead got through too. How? How did that get through, man? And I guess I'm just gonna consistently eco here, dude. <laughs> we, I, I'm pretty confident, boys, that we have lost this game. I just, I don't know how we're gonna win this. It just, no, there's just no way. Wow, and he literally just sold his sniper. That's the only tower he's got on his side to go for that ability so that he can get more money. That's ridiculous because he doesn't need to eco anymore. His main source of income is obviously from that sniper. And this strategy is really, really broken. And NK has yet to realize that. Okay, so I don't know what we're gonna do here, boys. We might just have to be aggressive on round 18. Might be able to pull through with the quick win. I'm not sure, boys. Oh no, he, 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 he's sending these leads. Okay, so this is not good. This is not good. I'm gonna have to go for a glue hose for sure. I'm about to be able to here any second. I'm gonna boost this. Because that, that's a lot. That's a lot of freaking balloons, boys. Oh, I think I'm dead. Oh, no. I barely hold on. He's got enough money to already get up another 2-3 sniper. <laughs> this game is a joke, boys. This game is a freaking joke. No freaking way. I, I guess I'm going to send him fast cool on ceramics and just see if that happens to get through. Uh, you never know, boys. You never know. 
Uh, they are getting through. Okay, so he's going to end up using a lightning bolt. Ooh, wait, this actually kind of looks bad for him. It kind of looks bad. He ends up damage boosting. Okay, so we'll take that. We'll take that 100%. And <laughs> he's giving us a face bomb. Dude, if I went at a quick shot, that would have been OP. That would 100% be OP. Okay, so he's got that damage boost. I think I just, I'm going to sell my glue here. And then just, mm, I, I need more money, you know. I need, I definitely need more money. Okay, so let's just send these fast cooldowns to ram it. Oh my goodness, boys. I mean, I'm dead to the AI. Wow. That is nuts. Yeah. I mean, I said it from the get-go. Why did I play this game? <laughs> Lift off is going to be our next opponent. I should have just listened to myself, boys. I really should have. I knew it wasn't going to work out, but I tried my best. All right. I, I really thought we had a shot for a second, but dude, he just has way too much money with that strategy. He instantly, he gets up so many snipers left and freaking right without ecoing since round eight, nine, 10, whatever he stopped. That strategy is nuts. Okay. NK, if you're watching this, please nerf that strategy. Please. I guess Interchange is going to end up being the map, okay? So we're not getting the best options uh, for these late game maps, but I, I guess it could maybe work, okay? Maybe we can work this out. All right, boys. So we got yet again another Darling Farm user, okay? So he's probably going with the Boomer, though, which means he does not want this game to go late. So he's probably going to be kind of aggressive towards me, um, also considering I'm starting off with a Ninja. So yeah, Red's going to be sent towards us. 100%. I already went for the 2-1. It sucks, but it's just what we got to do, ladies and gentlemen. I think he's going to have to also upgrade uh, to the power of darts, okay? So we'll be seeing him do that. And yes, you can see, okay? If you look closely at his dart lane, since he has that red circle on his head, that means he did, in fact, upgrade to the power of darts. And he's still consistently sending me eco here, which is kind of surprising, okay? Because I know for a fact he is farming. That's why he has that banana farmer on his side. So a little weird, a little strange. I'm just going to end up going for the double shot. It sucks, but just what we got to do. He ends up finally stopping. He should have stopped a long time ago, you know, because he still doesn't have a single farm on his side. He's going to finally go for it, it looks like. Um, and these consistent blues on his side, he's not going to be liking those, okay? He's going to have to eventually upgrade, especially on round six, okay? We're going to use our first super ego boost at the start of round five for sure. There we go with that. He's also got the super ego boost, okay? So quite interesting indeed yeah dude he's already starting to chase quite a bit already starting two leak lives to the ai he's gonna have to do something and yes i was right dude i literally read kids like books man i do i always call what kids are doing man that is insane okay but he's got the boomer we're gonna make sure that we stay pretty consistent still with this eco because looks like he's low-key kind of struggling a little bit i can't send too many greens at a time though which is kind of bad but whatever we're gonna use our next super eco boost i don't know how but he's still somehow freaking leaking boys so i think right here we're gonna send him like one last set of greens and then some space blacks all behind that because we have got to start saving up money for round eight defenses 100 percent got another 68 though and you upgrade to the buyer boomer no freaking way he, he's so mad okay so 100 percent he's gonna be sending us yellows there's no ifs or buts about it right and yep here he comes with those yellows okay so obviously i'm gonna have to end up um, glue storming or boosting so i'll use a glue storm there 100 percent oh we're gonna still tank a decent amount of lives right there okay that kind of sucks <laughs> i just waited a little bit too long all good though i'm gonna have to go oh no see like this village can't fit in this like little spot okay so that's not affected by the village that is though <laughs> voltrix you are dumb bro okay so this ninja is barely within range and when i say barely i mean barely we're gonna use our last super ego boost at the start of round 12 because i forgot as usual let's go for that let's get up the radar scanner as well because we want that camel lead detection and he's preparing for his defense a little bit more too i'm gonna send him a camel lead that's gonna force um some upgrades on his side on his dart lane and i guess we'll just play it safe here okay i'm gonna end up just space decoying and minding my own business okay because uh, he could send us a rush at any time. Uh, I'm probably just going to sell this. Yeah, I could sell this, okay? And we could eco maybe a little bit harder, okay? Because we still do have one more glue storm. And we're going to make sure that we have a solid amount of eco uh, for these later game rounds for sure, okay? <laughs> he is not happy. He is not freaking happy, ladies and gentlemen. He's only revealed one power of the super eco boost, but I highly doubt he has anything else up his sleeve. Hopefully, I am right about that because I don't want to speak too soon. You never know, boys. Somebody could have power lock, something like that. Uh, so you always got to stay cautious for sure. And our defenses are not even that good right now. Okay, we got 1,020 eco. Uh, yeah, I was about to say, I should probably cool it off a little bit. 
Pro probably a little bit for sure. Um, I'm definitely going to end up glue storming that. I also might, in fact, have to boost this because, wow, this looks so... Oh my gosh, this is so bad for us. This is so bad for us. This is so bad for us. Did I just choke this? I might have just choked this. I still can't get up the balloon jutsu. No. Oh, oh my gosh. Okay. Oh, oh, oh my gosh. Holy crap. We end up barely. And when I say barely, I mean barely. Holding on. That, that was intense, okay? That, that was quite intense. So I should probably go with the glue hose. Um, and I'm going to set it to strong in case he wants to send me a mod because that is definitely likely. Oh, he's power locking me too. Great. Great, great, great. Yeah. Oh my God. He's got quick shot too. Oh, I was wrong. I was freaking wrong, ladies and gentlemen. He's got the quick shot. We are 100%. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We can damage boost. Oh, please be enough. Please be enough somehow. Please be enough somehow. I went for another balloon jitsu. That might just be enough. Oh my god, it was. Oh my god, it was. No freaking way. No way that was enough. No way. He had the power. Dude! I'm free. I spoke it into existence. I literally spoke it into existence. There is no way, boys. Okay, so I think though with two balloon jitsus, we should be fine. He's going to end up turbocharging that. Uh, so yeah, he's going to ultimately be all good. But my goodness, was that freaking intense. He might have to turbocharge again. I'm just going to make sure that I stay pretty consistent with like eco and whatnot. And he ends up... Oh my gosh. Oh my freaking goodness, boys. We end up clutching with the dub. <laughs> Let's freaking go, boys. Oh my god, that broken power combination was not enough for my late game strategy. Okay, so we didn't really go late with this strategy, okay? But definitely in a future video, we're going to be using this again. Let me know down in the comment section below if I should use this strategy again. But that's gonna be wrapping up today's video. So I hope you guys did in fact enjoy. Make sure to drop a like on the video if you did. And also while you're at it, make sure to click that subscribe button, all right? So the last question I asked you guys in the last video was, do you guys believe I could have won the game in the last video against that pro player if I would have countered, all right? And the answer is yes, all right? So this guy won, congratulations, man. Just want to clear a few things up. He did not have that much money to ground zero, okay? I saw so many comments like that. He, he just simply couldn't. Maybe he could defend club. But if I would have sent him a huge, huge all out, he wasn't going to infinitely defend like constant mods, you know? But once again, congrats on the shout out, brother. So the next question I'm going to be asking you guys is, was the strategy that I created in today's video low-key a little bit OP, all right? That rhymed, make sure to leave your answers down below in the comment section. And you may have the chance to win a shout out in the next video, which is obviously dope. I hope you boys enjoy. Once again, it's been your Wobo Tricks or Justin. Peace out, everybody.